Okay, I need to get out of here. My buddy's got buckets hanging from his maple trees, and I'm going to go steal some sap. So if I can get away with this, I'm coming back here, and Muskrat Gulch is going into the maple syrup industry. So I'll be back. You think? Yeah. I remember. Now, is this enough to boil? Oh, yeah. It may not get much. Oh, we'll, we'll stop down at, before you leave, we'll stop down at Red Heart. Uh, we'll stop down the sugar shack. So, okay. Start to run yep. now. Yep. Yep. Oh, you found it. So my, my buddy gave me about five gallons of maple sap from his trees. And I'm going to try to make some maple syrup out of it. So the first thing I'm doing is running it through some cheesecloth just to, to strain out any particles that might have gotten in the sap buckets. And then we'll put it on the heat. I think it's a very big deal him giving away five gallons of sap like this. It doesn't come easy. We got a little bit of that, a little bit of larger particles, but not much. That looks pretty good. So that looks like an awful lot, but it's not really. That might give us a cup, maybe a little bit more of of syrup when we're done. Now we're going to take it outside and put it on the propane burner. Uh, before she left the house this morning, Teresa made it very clear that this is not something we do in the house. No sense of adventure in that one. So we'll take it outside and get it started. It's a little windy out here today, so let's light this up and see what happens. On goes her pot. So we got to bring that up to 220 degrees and then we we'll let her boil. So it's not quite boiling yet, but you can see that it's already changing the color. Um, kind of excited about this. You can see it's really boiling down. I probably lost two inches off it already. So we want this at about 220 degrees. Get in there. Okay, we're at 220 now. Oh my god, this is boring. I'd rather be gone. See you later. Wow, she can really take one for the game, can't she? So here we are now, we're getting a much darker color than it was. Um, I'm thinking I'm going to put it in a, a pot and put it on the stove for a bit in the house. Alright, so I think I've boiled my five gallons down as much as I can outside on the propane burner. So now I brought it in the house, put it in a smaller pot, and we're going to finish it on the stove. 
So after a little more than three hours, um, the last hour of it spent indoors on the stove, that's the result of the muskrat gulch maple syrup experiment. Uh, tastes some good, though, I'll tell you. I'm going to be very uh, picky about who I give samples to, though. Um, it's like it's like gold there. But anyway, it was a fun experiment. I don't know what we get out of that, but, but I'm getting six or eight ounces of maple syrup, that's for sure. Thanks for joining me. So you just witnessed the muskrat gulch foray into the maple syrup industry. Thank you to Matt and his friends for, for letting us take that sap. They gave us a bucket this size. It was full right to the top. I'm not sure what that is in gallons. The bucket says 13 kilos. I don't know what that is in, in liquid. But it was full right to the top. And by the time we got done boiling it, we ended up with two 400 ml bottles of maple syrup. And was it a day well spent? Yeah, it was. It was 17 degrees out, the nicest day we've had all, all year. Um, spent the day on the deck with my dog. Um, yeah, it was, it was a good day. Um, I'm, going, I'm going to be very picky in who I share this with, I can tell you that. Um, my blood sugar levels say I can't put a straw in there and drink it, but, but I'll be having some. It tastes pretty good. Now, don't forget... Um, the Women That Hunt every Tuesday, Muskrat Gulch every Thursday. And you need to remember that during the month of uh, April, we're going to be working at giving somebody this mug. And I was at I was at Kelly's last night, and she stuck something in there. And that's what we're doing all month. Um, you're not just getting this beautiful mug from Precious Artworks and Prints. Um you're getting a mug that's full. This is a stuff this muggy then. And and I have to return this to Kelly for her Women That Hunt video Tuesday. And when I get it back on Wednesday, I expect something else in there. And we're not telling you what's in it, but uh, I think... Some somebody's gonna be awful lucky to win this by the end of the month. So, so don't forget you gotta share it with your friends. You've gotta go into the the Women That Hunt YouTube channel and find your favorite video, whether it's Women That Hunt or Muskrat Gulch, it's up to you. And comment on your favorite video hashtag um, stuff this mug, and uh, somebody at the end of April is gonna take this home. So. Uh, Get after it, okay? We'll see you next week. Don't forget, win that hunt on Tuesday, Muskrat Gulch on Thursday. Till next time, thank you very much.